Hello people, and welcome back to Let's Build Bearable College. I've been trialling a new format this episode. Um, I've realised that building school does take a lot of time, so rather than sit through 20-30 minutes of just placing blocks, I figured I'd do more of a montage approach. So I'll set up the goals of each build session, and then we'll go through a fast forward to the actual building, and then we'll see the end result. Where possible, I'll include photo uh, comparisons. If I have photos, uh, I actually don't have a lot of photos of the school. But uh, we'll see how it turns out towards the end. As you can see, I haven't placed the roof on the block just yet, so we've got a nice aerial view of the floor plan for the block. Uh, the goal for this episode will be to refurbish the furniture inside B10 and then we'll be building the B8 classroom. I've mentioned in the previous episode that I kind of messed up the ratio for the B block and as a result the B classrooms are a bit uh, wider than they should be in real life. So as a consequence of me having not quite gotten the uh, B12 room and the B11 room quite the right size, I do have to stretch out these rooms and I don't, I don't know, it's not that bad, uh, it, it'll still feel right. Uh, so part of what I have to do is to uh, patch up the classroom, so I've originally made the desks very close together, they are kind of that close in, in real life but uh, because I need to make the classroom a bit longer, what I've chosen to do is to uh, reset the desk so there's more space between them. Um, they're not this big in real life, I know that for certain, but uh, for the sake of Minecraft, I think this is about right. I mean, you still recognise that when you walk in the room, you still recognise, oh yeah, this is the BA classroom, the B10 classroom, so it's about right. Um, I was originally, originally a bit confused about the actual layout of the room because uh, I'm pretty sure that B10 and B8 both point in the same direction, whereas the B6 classroom points in the other direction. Uh, B6 is actually now a corner's office, uh, it was temporarily done so because of a, I'm sure it's temporary, it might be permanent, but uh, for now it's temporary. That's what temporary means, but uh, yeah, uh, it's a bit uh, different now. I'll get to that later. So this is the uh, the B10 classroom. Uh, again, it's a bit wider than what I would like it to be, but it's close enough. It looks about right, and uh, if you get uh, a bit of an aerial view later on, you can see it looks uh, about right. So that's that's pretty good to me. Uh, I just need to patch up the uh, windows here because I have to stretch up the classroom. That's quite a bit of a stretch um, to think, if you think about it, but uh, it looks alright. Um, again, the, the outside of the building looks okay. Um, it's funny because this time I've kind of prioritised the outside of the building more than the inside. I'm using the uh, I'm using C block as a bit of a guideline, that's where things should be, uh, based on the school map and school diary. So it's about the right size, just the inside looks a bit weird, but uh, that looks about right for the B10 classroom. Next, I need to lay the foundations for the B8 and probably the B6 classroom as well. It's a bit tedious, so I'll fast forward through this. Basically, I need a layer of carpet, uh, I need some sandstone for the uh, corridors and the walls, and uh, bricks for the outside. Now that we have the floor plan in place, I'm going to put together the B8 classroom furniture. Uh, it's an identical setup to the B10 classroom. It has the inverted uh, E shapes, which Barrowman College is very fond of. So I'm going to fast forward and just lay down the, uh, the, the floor plan. Um, as you can see, uh, again, it's a bit longer than when it's real life. I'm exaggerating the length because I don't quite have the right uh, proportions in Minecraft, but uh, it looks about right. Uh, I actually like the compressed uh, size a bit better. Next, we'll be completing the uh, outside of the uh, classroom. So we'll put doors in, the windows, and the wall. So we'll uh, put the windows in here. And uh, something which I should note is these windows are actually uh, head high, so you can see inside the classroom. Uh, you can't do it in Minecraft because uh, your main character is slightly shorter than average. Uh, so the windows aren't, they are the right height, just that your character is too short to see through them, but they're about right. Finally, just to conceal the uh, the extra whiteboard blocks I've put in, I'm going to use paintings to uh, put uh, quote unquote student work in the background. So uh, it looks a bit more natural, more classroom like. Plus, I've put some filing cabinets and a rubbish bin. So there we have it. We have the B10 and BA classrooms done. Hope you enjoyed this episode and hope to see you next time.